The high school football season is officially underway for our friends above the border in Georgia. However, some of our local teams that are in the Sunshine State Athletic Association also began their seasons with week zero action. The Pax and Eagles hosted the West Nassau Warriors on their brand new turf field tonight. We go to late in the second quarter. Pax and up 14 to 6 in West Nassau driving. Quarterback Price Arnold steps back, takes his time, launches it up to Avery Griffin. Wide open, a beautiful pass in the breadbasket, 46 yard touchdown. Touchdown. However, two point conversion, no good for the Warriors. Paxson still up 14 to 12. Now, same score with under a minute left in the third quarter. Warriors in scoring position, and Skyler Freeman gets in for the easy score. Two point conversion, good this time, and West Nassau up 20 to 14. Midway through the fourth quarter, Paxson backup quarterback AJ Davis in for a few plays. He takes a quarterback sneak. Tricks me, tricks the defense for the touchdown. Two point conversion, good. Paxson up 22 to 20. Now final chance for West Nassau. Fourth and goal with a yard to go under 15 seconds left in the game. Quarterback Arnold would go for it. He is stopped short. Second chance that is also just centimeters short of the goal line. Eagles come out on top with a tight victory, 22 to 20. No better way for the Eagles to start off a victory on a brand new beautiful field in their 2024 campaign. Now let's go right up Interstate 95 to Brunswick as the Pirates hosted Camden County in the GHSA season opener. Pirates down 3 nothing early in this one. Jeremiah Robbins takes the handoff. He would go on touch for a 60 Five yard touchdown. Nobody's catching up. The burner's too hot. Brunswick up seven to three and would eventually lead 14 to three. Now Camden County would go up 30 to 20. They're receiving the kickoff early in the third quarter. David Coleman Jr. takes this from the 10 yard line and Camden County unbelievable blocking. He goes almost untouched for the 90 yard touchdown. Camden County goes up 37 to 20 and big plays continued for both teams all night. But Camden County comes out on top 51 to 41 in the high powered offensive battle. And just a quick reminder, the FHSAA kicks off the football regular season next Friday, August 23rd. That means you can catch our ultimate game day experience show next Friday at 7.30 p.m. on ABC 25 as we get you all pumped up for the new season. Plus, Sideline 2024 debuts next Friday night, 11.15 p.m. as we'll have all your highlights.